Okay, so what we have here is a compound interest, but now rather than doing daily, monthly, yearly, annually, or semi-annually, uh, uh, bi-weekly, uh, hour, not hourly, but because um, <clears throat> everything's done through a year. But now they're saying we're having to deposit $5,000 in an account that pays 8% annual uh, interest, but it's now it's gonna be compounded continuously. All right, and when compounding continuously, that's going to bring in our lovely number E. And it's also gonna change our uh, formula a little bit. Um, and now to the continuously compounded formula, which a lot, of, a lot of times I just like to call PERT because it's your principal times the constant E raised to your an annual interest rate in, uh, in decimal form times T, which is years. So again, we need to be able to figure our final value. So we're gonna have A equals, our principal in this case is $5,000 times E, which is going to, uh, it's going to be a constant which we'll use in our calculator, times our interest rate um, in decimal form, which is be 0 0.08, times T, which is in years. All right, now usually when dealing with this formula, I always like to simplify the exponent first because I know that that's going to be a little bit more difficult um, raising it. But however, it, rather than dealing with uh, so much order of operations, this one's actually pretty basic um, as far as you can just plug this in your calculator and it'll be pretty, uh, you won't really have too many difficulties really go through. But anyways, let's just kind of go through this step by step just to make sure that we're on the right page. So if I do 0 0.08 times uh, 15, I get 1.2. So I can say A equals $5,000 times E raised to the 1.2. Now I know when I take my constant E and raise it to 1.2, I'm going to left with uh, 3.320, and I'll just round that out times 3.32012 times my final value A equals 1,600. Uh, I forgot to put in my money symbols. Right, you're dealing with money, so you gotta put in symbols. So therefore, you have 16,658 cents. If you initially invest $5,000 at 8% annual interest rates for 15 years and it's being compounded, uh, continuously, you'll um, have a lot of extra money. It looks like uh, $11,600. Um, $11, Not too bad just for putting money into an account, right? Thanks.